everyone welcome to emojo ias in this video we are going to see the dam safety bill of 2021 which was recently passed by our parliament about the bill the dam safety bill 2021 for your prelims you have to know about the provisions of this bill and its features and for your mains you have to know about the dam safety at a whole dam safety at a whole along with this bill for your mains and the features of this bill for the prelims and here i am going to tell you the uh, what are the uh, features of this bill and the aim of this bill in our exam perspective first of all we are going to begin with the bill provides for what are the things that this bill provides for there are four different things that is the first one is surveillance second one inspection third thing operation and maintenance of the dams this is what this bill provides for this bill is for uh, creating an infrastructure or of institutional framework for the surveillance inspections operation maintenance of the dams of india and what is the aim of this bill why such a bill is introduced in a parliament and what are the need of this bill the aim is to prevent disasters prevent disasters and ensure a safety ensure a safety mechanism this is what an overall view of this bill and you have to uh, always remember that this bill is for surveillance inspection operation and maintenance of the dams of india and the aim of the bill is to prevent disaster and ensure a safety mechanism all over india here the next the applicability of the law and for which uh, how much dams how many dams are there under this law and what are the criteria for selection of such dam because we have lot of dams and reserves here uh, which have uh, we, we can't just count because there are many private uh, dams or reserves here that may be constructed in a private land property and all so we are going to discuss what are they what are the uh, area where this bill is applicable and according to this bill 5000 dams comes under this bill in india uh, now selected only 5000 dams but there are more dams in this category and uh, what is the criteria for selection the criteria is the dam should be at least 15 meters in height so the dam constructed or the check dams are there which are uh, below the 15 meters height such dams does not include in this law because this dams is only for the dams uh, with 15 meters or above 15 meters but in some special conditions dams below 15 meters that means 10 to 15 meters will also comes under the applicability of the law that is dam safety bill of 2021 and this is all the applicability of the law the first provision and this bill provides for an establishment of national committee on dam safety and this committee is uh, chaired by chairman of this committee is central water commissioner who chairs this committee and the members of this committee this uh, committee have members from both central as well as state government representatives that means the chairman is central water commissioner and 10 representatives were nominated by center and seven representatives from different state governments and 3 expert members expert in dam safety they may be uh, the fear people may be a dam engineering graduates or the people having experience in dam safety management and all and these are the composition of this committee that is national committee on dam safety 
and let's look into the functions of this committee functions are the first function is to formulate policies and this committee will be uh, will be the agency which formulate policy to prevent dam failures and the second important function of this committee is to uh, analyze the reasons for dam failures analyze the reason when they are analyzing if there if an event of dam failure occurs anywhere in india this committee will be the agency which analyze the reasons for this failure and they will suggest measures to prevent such failures in future and this is the important functions of this committee that is national committee on dam safety just recall the provisions of this national committee on dam safety and this committee will be that is nc ncds and this committee will have members that from center as well as state from the central government it will have 10 representatives and from state government it will have seven representatives and three experts from dam safety management and these are the composition of the national committee on dam safety and their functions include the important function is formulating policies to prevent uh, dam failures and the second thing is if an event of dam failure occurs they will analyze the reason for such failure and suggest measures to overcome that particular situation as well as to prevent such failures in future and this is the this is all about the national committee on dam safety Next, the second provision of this act is then is uh, it provides for the establishment of national dam safety authority ndsa and this authority have uh, the function of implementation of policies that means the national committee on dam safety is for formulation of policy right that we know so this committee will be the implementing agency of the policies of national committee on dam safety and this is safe dam the national safe, dam safety authority will be the agency to resolve issues between state dam safety agency or organization and dam owners okay this will be these this agency will be the uh, agency that resolve issues between dam owners and uh, different states and all and the next important function of this authority is they are the people who specify regulations for the inspection of dams And the other function is accreditation. And these agency will give accreditations to agencies which are working on structure of dams and uh, their alteration. Okay, this is the function of national dam safety authority they are the implementing agency of the policies that are formed by the national committee of dam safety and this agency will resolve the issues between the dam safety organization of the states with the dam owners and then this agency will specify the regulation for inspections of the dams and this will give the accreditation to the agencies which are responsible on working on the structure of the dam and their alteration the third important provision is the state dam safety organization and the state committee on dam safety sorry it's o okay the first the state dam safety organization the jurisdiction of dam safety organization of particular state will be extended to all dams in that specific state then you automatically you will be getting a doubt that what if a dam is in a cross border if there is a cross border dam or there is any issues between two states with the ownership of the dam then it will be comes under the national dam safety authority in case of crossing borders 
otherwise all other dams are comes comes under the state uh, dam safety organization's jurisdiction and the next thing is the state dam safety organization will be the agency for maintaining the database database of all the dams in that particular state and the state committee on dam safety also it is, uh, gives a provision for the establishment of state committee on dam safety like they have in the center and the function of such committee is to review state dam safety organization because all the function are vested with this dam safety organization of the state so this committee will be a review they they just review the functions of sdso and this is if and uh, this is the third provisions of this bill and the next provision is fourth thing the next provision is this bill also provide for amendments that means if any of the features that mentioned above or I, that i explained uh, before this will be get amended by central government if necessary so this will give the power to central government to amend any of the about provisions relating to the dam safety bill of 2021 and these are all the provisions of this bill just remember there are four provisions uh, always remember that the first provision is the national committee on um, dam safety and the second thing is the national dam safety authority and the third thing is the dam safety organization of the state as well as the state committee on dam safety and the fourth thing is the bill or the bill itself provide for the uh, feature of amendment by the central government if necessary in the above mentioned features of this act finally here we will be just going through the some uh, importance and drawbacks of this bill what are the importance of the bill because when we have such an organization which completely responsible for the dam safety in india it will ensure a safety mechanism right and this ensure a regular inspections and this will help in reducing issues between state governments and people reducing issues and clashes extra such benefits are there with this act but at the same time there are some drawbacks or some something that the government because this bill was already passed by our Lok Sabha in 2019 but only in 2021 just our day before this was passed by the Rajya Sabha but that was also after a long debate and many opposition parties like mainly Tamil Nadu was opposing this bill why these people are opposing this bill the first drawback is this comes under the water right and the water is under state list but the central government is making such a regulation in this regard so this sometimes this seems as a controversial controversy to our constitution or it's not uh, what not in line up with the provisions of the constitution because it is entering into the ambit of the state government and the second thing is this why Tamil Nadu is opposing this act means the four dams four dams that are under the ownership of Tamil Nadu is actually under the area of Kerala so such a bill will be uh, affect the ownership of the Tamil Nadu so that's why they, they are protesting or they are not accepting this bill and this is all at the about the drawbacks this can't be tell as a drawback this is all the um, opposition that is coming arising out of this bill and this is all about this bill and you can uh, expect a question in this regard in your mains also because it is a very current topic that is going on in india and this is all about the bill that is the dam safety bill of 2021 if you have any doubt please ask me in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe our channel and to click the bell icon bye